know, this is some deepy, deep sand, baby. Oh, uh, yeah, just don't go down. I, you, 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 you. I don't think the Nats was on us because they thought it was a pile of shit. <laughs> but we found our own Florida spring. We got Well, what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel today we're waking up at a camp on some wildlife management land and uh, we're going to continue our trip to florida on the georgia adventure trail so all we got to do is pack up camp we got a little bit of stuff packed up and get a little bit of late start because we thought it was going to rain but as you can see the weather's looking a little cloudy but sun's over there a little decent right now, so we uh, no yeah so no right now no rain we're going Head on trail, we'll film as much as we possibly can. And uh, uh, today I think we're gonna be in sand most of the day, so it should be interesting. So buckle up, follow along, hit that like and subscribe button. And let's get after it, let's go. All right, we packed it off. Leave it, oh, leaving this uh, campground. Try to look at the name of it. I don't know what the name of this place is. Jimmy just seen a sign down there that said that was uh, the wildlife management area. It's Oka Oka Maji. Something like that. Wildlife area. I don't. So you probably can look that up. Like I said, it's Oka Oka Maji. Look at that, man. See, people, there's today's beauty that's uh, out here just like they are in the mountains. It's because you're in the flat ground. Farms are cool looking. Look at that big ass water. Uh, yeah, I know. Right here on your right. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It runs across that whole damn field when it needs to. Farmland, the heart of America, baby. I don't know part of Georgia we in somewhere in there going towards Hawkingsville. Sounds down that way, I don't really know. Still on the Georgia Adventure Trail. Yes, Timmy can check the sand for you. Look, look how deep it is now. Look, that's how deep it is. But look at the turtle. Huge. Say nice turtle. Nice turtle. Look at him. Hey, cool. I've seen them in Florida before, but never out here in this middle of nowhere. Pretty neat. See you, turtle. I made it first through the first deep sand section. I went down. I don't know if it's on camera. It probably was. I don't know. I went down. What? The bike got caught on my caught my foot a little bit got a little tweaky tweaky on the back of my ankle but I think I'm gonna be all right still making our way Georgia Adventure Trail to Florida let's have to watch out for the deep section the deep deep sand section things are about what that was about that was over a foot deep ain't it oh yeah of white sugary sand so that was that edit sand yeah just beware of that this right here is pretty hard packed. It's a little bit loose on the top, but as long as you maintain throttle, you're good. So deep sand is a little different, so be careful. Don't wipe out too hard. Well, we'll keep on keeping on. Maybe yet a different type of terrain now. We're back in some kind of sand mud mixture. I don't know what this is. I don't know what it is. <laughs> looks like it's been flash plowed, whatever. Yeah, it looks like it has. I'm trying to we hit it. Most of it's kind of packed like this, like in this track right here, but. We hit a couple spots back there, the camera wasn't on, but it was uh, deeper, muddier ruts. Definitely probably don't want to get caught on this in a hard downpour either. Probably got rutted all up, you know what I mean? Look at all that stuff, y'all. Look. <laughs> yeah, hold oh, got a jump right there. Thank y'all. Look. He was flying, boy. Damn, okay, now we got another critter on the lip. <laughs> It's getting critters today. Today's the Critter Nature Channel. Critter uh, on the Bearded Grunt, we go. Now we went from ADV Channel to Critter Channel. Nature Channel. Join us on our. Back to the Bearded Grunt Nature Channel. Yeah, join us on our nature hikes. Anybody know what kind of plant that is? I have no idea. Or weed? That stuff right there, right there. That ain't no weed, is it? I don't know what it is. Never seen it before. <laughs> cool looking, whatever it is. Makes me feel like I'm in the jungle. I'm in the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. <laughs> yeah, Alright, we're making our way along. Uh, you can see there's been a lot of different terrain 
changes the terrain like dirt it's been white sand dark sand some little bit of red mud this is a little wet here if you can see it it's so deep you got some kids shampoo over here if you're dirty and kids shampoo i will tell you one thing about this route though if you take breaks so i don't know if you can catch them on camera they have tons of gnats boy. I'm telling you so just be be prepared for that if you catch some breaks out here because there are tons of gnats but we're gonna keep on making it on looks like we got about we done put down about i don't know 80 miles maybe somewhere around there 75 we got about another 80 to go is that what it looks like anyway florida on our mind baby florida and georgia on our mind we're gonna make it let's do it baby oh cow the cows right there look at that one yeah cows to the neighborhood it just change, changes so much. Oh, yeah, dirt right there is black. Yeah, had black sand in there. All the way down, too. Never know there's that too many type of, different types of sand and roads down this way. So any of y'all people live in the deep south of Georgia, it's a good, a pretty good riding down here. I got a lot of dirt roads, that's for sure. Oh, look at that anger thing. Look at that thing. Come on, fly. Fly, buddy. Yes. That's cool, look, he's flying with us. He's going us away, man. Yeah, he is. Take us to Florida, baby! Yeah, thank you. Oh, that's cool, dude. He don't know what to do, does he? Uh, that's cool. That was awesome. Now we have a little bit deeper stuff as we're getting closer and closer to Florida. Sand's pretty deep. I just crossed with this. Didn't go down, though. You can tell, I mean, I hope you can tell on the camera how deep that is. Deep. In the middle, it's deep. It's staying packed right here on some tire tracks. Then all of a sudden, like I said, it'll change. It'll come become more tight packed. We still, still, we're going 25 now, so we ain't dropped much below our 30. We're just trying to keep it safe and steady. No crashes when you're on long trips. I did that already today and see, look at the bike. Look at the bike. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Wiggle, 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 we're wiggle. Trying wiggle. not to crash on, well, uh, not hard on big trips because we're trying to complete missions. Oh, These ain't day rides. Pretty deep stuff. Right, slow us down a little bit. Oh, shit. Slow us down a little bit. Okay. You crawl through it for some reason. Ain't okay, you know, no Timmy's still back there. I am. Okay. Ah, oh, you good. Just, I just want to make sure you ain't down. I, I, was, I almost went down. I almost went down like twice already. <laughs> this is a rough one. This is a rough one here. Well, we're not professional sand riders by any means. We don't ride this stuff here. It's only the second time we've ever done it. So I'm sure we got wrong technique and everything else. We're trying. Let's see if Timmy's back there. I'm going to stop, which I don't like doing. Make sure he didn't fall. Yeah, don't. Uh, if you get on there, just keep your pace and then don't stop. Just go past me. I'll catch up. Yeah, just focus, focus way out here. Try your best. And I, I started riding in the middle. It's easier. Believe it or not. <laughs> I know. I just uh, I couldn't get stood back up back right there. Yeah, just just keep just keep on going. If you don't stop your momentum, unless you will. Yeah, that's just this is too long. That's gonna be hell. Yeah, maybe, maybe it won't. Like I said, you know how it goes. We might be in this section and then come right back out of it, you know. You can take off there. Oh, come. Yeah, y'all, we ain't professionals. You see how deep this stuff is. Eh? This is a deep sand section here. Trying to stay behind, get some film with Timmy. Y'all said y'all wanted Timmy cam, so we got you one. Everybody struggles in this unless you just ride it all the time. This is the second time ever we ever rode that deep sand like that, ever in our life. Can't, can't expect to be professionals at it when we just they ain't never done it. If you live down here, you're probably a little better at it, I would imagine. Y'all can comment on that too. If you live in these sandy areas, you ride it all the time, you get professional at it. And you get where you can ride it one handed or. I don't know about that. Now pack back out. It's weird. It does that down here. I don't know what does that either. A little sandy areas. It goes to deep sand and it goes back to a hard pack. It's weird. Now more deep stuff, it looks like. Yeah. Yeah, it ain't as deep as that back there though, was it? I don't think so. Nah. I ain't as bad.
bad. Oh, yeah, just don't go down. It's not, you, 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 don't hurt your shoulder. If you start to go down, get away from it, let it go. You know what I mean? I don't want to have to pick it up. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. But I know I'll help you pick it up. I, I mean, we done said that. It was about two of us. Damn, man. Yeah. Ain't no man cards involved in that. This is, this is a hell in it. Yeah. Do like that right there. <laughs> it's way harder if you sit down, I can guarantee you that. Keep a steady pace just like that. Never chop that throttle. You go like 10. It'll go right through. Say we want to put our toes in the sand, we didn't. Know. Yeah, our toes are inside of our boots, but we put them in the sand either way. Yeah. This is a tough boy. Yeah, do this all day long. See, like we said, now you're back to hard pack. Chilling. Spanish moss everywhere. Deep sand has come out of nowhere. We struggled a little bit. It's the only second time we rode it though, so we did pretty good, Timmy. Pretty good, yep, pretty good. This is uh, Lakeland, Georgia. This little town you gotta go through. About 35 miles away from the end of the route uh, to Jennings, Florida. And just outside of Lakeland, Georgia, see, you're back on, maybe go down the road about a mile or two and you're back on off road again. I don't guess yourself why you ride adventure bikes, and especially us doing these longer trips, probably sometimes like this. But to say that you rode a motorcycle from Anderson, South Carolina, where we live, down to Florida on about 80%, or probably about 90% off road. But it's like you do this, and like when you get done, we only got now maybe 20 miles to go. but. It's like you get down there, you reach your goal, makes you feel good about yourself. Plus, you're like, I rode to Florida on the dirt on a big motorcycle. Yeah. <laughs> and camped the whole way. This is the black gateway to Florida. <laughs> you know Yeah. All right. This ain't the end of the video, but we're coming to the end of the Georgia Adventure Trail. Right here. That's it. We're in Florida right now, as soon as we cross this stop sign. We have been through the whole center of the state of Georgia, and now we're in Florida. We made it. Boom, right there. We have done it. We have done it. We have done it, baby. See, that point says we're over. It's over. We made it. <laughs> All right, the Georgia Adventure Trail is completed. About another 200-mile day. But now we're in, uh, so it ended in Jennings, Florida. Now we're in just outside of Madison, Florida. We're going to go to Madison Blue Spring. Uh, tomorrow, but just to uh, give you a little shot of the camp that we got here There's the camp. I said not the greatest place a lot of gnats down here. We got a tent set up though Bike area do got some porta potties down there. We can use We're supposed to bring us some water so we can wash off in those barrels down there a little sandy road out there We finish unpacking everything And we'll see what we can get cooked up tonight. Yeah, you know, we walked through the trek down through here to get to the river of alligators. <laughs> oh, oh, what river? This is a river. Look at that. I'm school river, but I think it's flowing pretty hard, huh? Yeah. There's the river, y'all. I don't know how much alligators like the river with Timmy in it. <laughs> you know what? I don't know if there's alligators in there. The lady didn't say nothing about it. We in Florida. <laughs> I asked great to ask, but I think it's probably flowing too hard. Maybe there might be some alligators in it. You know, it's cool looking though with all the Spanish malls and stuff. Y'all can see that down there with the river in there. Alligator. Pretty neat, isn't it? If alligator was here, he'd be in that still of water waiting to chill. Yeah, waiting to chill, yeah. We just make a lot of noise. We made it! We have made it! We have made it! That's what you got to do when you're out motorcycle riding, boy. <laughs> yeah, You've been dirty all day, two days. Feels great, too, Almost 500 guys. miles. Feels great. This I know the water ain't as clean as ever, but yeah, take a bath in this thing. Feels great. Water's a little chilly. Yeah, especially when you got uh gnats all over you. Hopefully, it's going to deter them. Been I think dirty, they, been I dirty they were, for two days. Yeah, I think the gnats was on us because they thought it was a pile of shit. <laughs> you're not clean unless you're a bit of grump clean. Hey, it's when you know you made it in life when you. And you got dang swimming in a dirty river taking a bath behind yeah. a church in Florida for my campground. That's yeah. something crazy. And camping off motorcycles. That's how you do this is how you do that's how you do motorcycle adventure trips. <laughs> that's how right you there. do moto camping, baby. <laughs> Woohoo!
Yep, it ain't that hard. Huh? Yeah, it sure ain't that hard. But, same from over there, of course. Across the river, but we found our own Florida spring. Look at the, look at the water change. Look at that. Oh, it's cold, too. It's cold, yeah. You tell a huge, huge, huge difference in water change. Oh. It's cold. It's got some leaf matter on the bottom, but it's still crystal clear. This is where it comes out over here. Right there. So that's where it flows out of. Probably can't see the water bubbling on top. So let's take it down there. The Florida Springs, baby. Right, we got this little fire going. We'll do a simple little meal tonight, I think, because we're tired. It's been a long day, but some chili down there warming up. Timmy, there. Timmy got his little stick shaved down. We're just gonna uh, do some simple uh, roasting some weenies for hot dogs. Eat the chili. Nothing too fancy tonight. It's like I said, it's been a long day. And uh, just wanted something simple, but hot. So that's what we're doing. Trying to get this fire going because all the wood soaked. It rained here right before we got here. So, But uh, yeah, we'll get to cooking and then we'll see what it tastes like. It's a simple camping meal, but it's gonna be good because we're hungry. All right, so. Our fire is blazing now. And if y'all if y'all knew at this, I don't think nobody over here watches us probably are, but see, you don't need no fancy, fancy weenie grilling stick. Just cut one off the tree, courtesy of Timmy. <laughs> he cut it for us, though it double, double decker, peace signs. These are that way so we can cook, yeah. Today. We can cook uh, two weenies at one time. So <laughs> see. Fry them up. Simple as that. We'll just cook them, slap them on a bun. The chili's down in that fire. I don't know how we're gonna get that out because we don't got no oven mitts or nothing. You can see it down in there. It's down in there, right where my thumbs are. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get it, but I said thumbs. I meant thumb. Yeah. So we're gonna see how that goes. Get us cooked up. Eat some hot dogs. Simple meal. All right, there it is. I know it ain't the prettiest thing in the world. We're gonna call these the Grumpy Hot Burgers. It's a hot dog weenie. We had to get hamburger buns because that's all they had, the family dollar in Jennings, Florida. <laughs> yeah, down Florida yeah. So we give it a taste test. We'll let Timmy taste test it right quick. It's getting dark on us. Yeah, all right. Let Timmy taste test it. That's pretty dang good, man. Delicious enough that's for the, yeah. delicious enough for a long that's day of riding. We're on a sandy riding day, yeah. yeah. So yeah, one more shot. Got some Doritos down there. Chili and Timmy bravely got out of that fire. So we'll get to eating. Hope it won't get dark by the time we get done. All right, uh, it got laid on us. We have people just pulling in, talking, uh, talking their ear off and just about <laughs> motorcycles and history It's of been Florida. a crazy day. It's all kind of stuff, but <laughs> yeah. uh, dinner was good. Our grumpy dogs or whatever you want to call them things. Uh, pretty good, just quick, simple, um, quick meal. But that was pretty good. Um, had a good day of riding on the trail. 200 miles almost all sand and probably a good 80 percent of it was off-road if i had to guess it was pretty rough but we made it through got some good swimming in the river got to see a little spring yeah that's only a taste of what's coming in day three the next video so this ain't the end of the trip this is only day two of a five day trip just the end of the video so right. stay tuned for for day number three and uh we'll see y'all in the next one thanks